you're here today in Sacramento where we're about to deliver petitions that 28,000 of you signed. The petitions are pretty straightforward. They tell the governor not to try to rescue his cash flow problem by reducing workers' wages to $6.55 an hour. The governor lives at the Hyatt. He uh, stays in a room that costs $293 dollars a night. Do you know if the governor is actually in the Hyatt right now? We don't know where the governor is. Uh, potentially he's working. That would be a good thing. It is rare to get this many signatures in such a short amount of time and it proves the point that people in California really do care what goes on here. By the way, you ask about the governor, there he goes in his motorcade. So I don't know where he's off to, but uh, I'm sure uh, it's somewhere to do some work with some people who might be paying for his hotel room. If we can get the uh, concierge to take these up to the governor, yeah. I mean, it'd be kind of nice if the governor would do some reading. <laughs> How are you? Good to see you. No, no, we're fine. Thanks. Go ahead. Okay, thank you. Thanks. We do have need some assistance. It's Assembly Member Jones. Hi. How are you? I'm Rick Jacobs. Nice to see you. I would love to take those, but unfortunately, I can't. Oh, okay. Oh, you can't. No. Oh. Um, his office is across the street, and you know we would just direct it you. Oh, you would. We have to go back over there because yeah. okay. we thought that this might get his attention if we actually he, he could know. do some night reading. Yeah, I have no yeah. clue. Excuse how, me. Yeah. Excuse me. Do you have permission for this? For what? To be in this hotel, filming like this. Well, I don't. I didn't know we needed permission. Okay. Well, we'll uh, we'll take these over to the office. Thank you I guess very much. maybe at a union hotel they they would take these up. Thanks. I've actually never been to the governor's office. We got twenty eight thousand people who are going with us. Hi there. Hi. How are you? We got some petitions for the governor here. And somebody popped their head out like from the Wizard of Oz and said, uh, "You have to take all those down to the mail room." Mail room. Mail room. I guess that's going to go to the mail room. You want the assembly member to go to the mail room? Um, well, I just got told by the governor's um, office. Is it something that they're expecting? They're well, just, it's petitions. Just petitions related to the executive order on from, uh, state workers. From uh, 28,000 people. Right. Yeah. Um, check. Yeah, let me, let me okay. check. Okay. Oh, well, that's we good. We just want to leave it at the front desk. We're yeah. not going to go any further than that. No, uh, <laughs> it's kind of heavy, so maybe we'll just set everybody right. down there. Excuse me. How are you? Uh, Hi. Uh, someone from the governor's office will be coming out momentarily. Oh, good. Oh, that's wonderful. Hey, Thank you very I much. That. Well, they must be pretty busy in there. And we waited another 10 minutes or so, and finally, the governor's press sec secretary came out and said he was really happy to uh, see us. I'm not sure he was. Hey, Mr. Hey, Mr. Press Secretary. Yeah, how are you? I'm great, thanks. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. Good. Sure. I'm uh, happy to take those two they're, they're, they're pretty heavy. Beautiful. I'm Rick Jacobs from Rick, the Courage Campaign. I've been we led this. Out, so I think I might be able to take it. You've got uh, people uh, not paying the state of California twenty-six million dollars, mm -hmm. so but they can have a yacht here and not pay sales tax. Right. On it. Those are the kinds of things that shouldn't be happening when you're right. trying to cut. And th wages. those are the types of things we're anxious for the legislature to work out so we can get that budget on time. If you get your Republicans, they will. All right. That's right. Well, thank you, gentlemen. Great. Thanks, thanks so much. Nice thanks. for your time. Thank you. It. Thanks. thanks again. Lift with your knees. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you have been working out. He's a pretty hefty guy, and he picked him up, took him inside, and he said he was going to make sure the governor saw him. They've already delayed two days or three days to sign this. Maybe they won't sign it at all, and you know why? It's because people took the time to write and let the governor know. Mm -hmm.